WTE6 on your side reporter Amanda Ketchledge takes us along for the first day for an eighth grader. Typically you get dropped off at school, but Connor Wilkerson and his mom are walking into Gibbs Middle School together. That's because Cindy is also a secretary at the new school and she's excited about what opportunities are available for her son. It's preparing him for everything, you know, they're going to have their Chromebooks, they've got the interactive TVs that they get to use, um, state of the art science labs. Connor is also hoping the advanced technology will help him with his assignments. It's going to be different having uh, technology. I mean, it, it makes it easier to do your work with the computers. This school is something the families in the area really wanted because the middle school students used to have to go to Holston Middle School, which is about a 20 minute drive from here. And I've wanted it ever since I l left elementary school. The principal, Cindy White, says the opening of the new school is a celebration, not just for the students, but everyone in this community. There's been a lot of time, a lot of hard work by this entire team to get this building open, and so this is a really exciting day for us. With his backpack stacked full of supplies, colored pencils, earbuds, Connor is ready to load up his locker and head to his first class. For his mom, Cindy, it's an extra special day. My mother was a Gibbs alumna, I'm a Gibbs alumna, my niece, and now my son. So this is pretty exciting for us as a family and as a community. You want your son to carry on that tradition? I do. You know, it's the pride in the G. You hear that saying all the time. And so it's very prideful for us to come back, be home, be in a state-of-the-art building. 550 students are currently enrolled, and Gibbs Middle School is capable of holding a total of 800 students in the future. In Knox County, Amanda Ketchledge, WATE, 6 on your side.